Welcome back. I'm here with Mr. Vance Telemac, and you're a poet, correct? Yeah, spoken word artist. Okay, so that's great. I love spoken word. Um, you're going to give us some poetry in a little while, correct? Yeah. Okay. Now, mind if I ask you, how long have you been doing poetry? I've been doing spoken word for about good eight years now. Okay, so... Okay, sorry about that. So you've been doing spoken word for about eight years now. Yeah, about eight years now. And when did you find your niche in that? I found my niche actually uh, here in Miami, Florida, the first time that I've been to the liter Literary Cafe mm -hmm. with uh, God Bless the Dead, uh, Will Bell. Mm -hmm. So I went there and um, I just, you know, because I was always a rapper, mm -hmm. but I just, you know, I was like, let me try something new. Let me try something different. And I just took a rap and I did it a little slower, did some pauses. And in those eight years, I realized that there's a big difference between rap and spoken word. Yes, yes, yes. Well, I look forward to hearing it from you, okay? Yeah. Well, it's a pleasure. It'll be a pleasure to share. Thank you. Um, before I step away, do you have any social media that you would like to tell the people where they can find you? Or Oh, yeah, definitely. You can find me at S-V-E-N-S underscore Telemac, which is T-E-L-E. M-A-Q-U-E, and on Facebook, you could find me there, and you could go to zvenstelemat.com. Okay, perfect. Thank you. That's rape. If rape is considered a sexual aggression, your words were like a crowbar at the edge of her door, continuously bending, sending the message that you would do no harm. Quite frankly, eyes that love can't see through charm. Every time she doubted, you would push and pry. She acted under the influence of your seductive eyes, your corruptive lies, your scandalous speech. You're a rapist, your ski mask embroidered with the words, je t'aime, chérie. Do you love me? Had an answer fabricated for such a purpose, so the dream the most skilled Native American couldn't catch. You had it to believe this was love and not a selfish act. With tact, you fled the scene as you've done many times before leaving behind casualties of your affection and then on the prowl for more. That's rape. She said, no, stop. You're hurting me. Please, no. But how could you be so vividly visceral, yet your soul so rotten and decomposed, blow after blow gripping her throat? You forced, causing damaging results. She entertains a constant guilt and shame. It was my fault. False love? is a weapon of mass destruction erupting hopes when she was like Mount St. Helens inactive. In practice, you were a thief. In theory, you were a priest hiding behind three-syllable words like ministry and family. That's rape. No, I don't speak to judge you, only to lead you to the truth, because at a time, I used to be you. That was great. That was really nice. Um, Thank you very much. I just want to applaud you on that because it was very strong and I felt it. And did you throw some French in there? Yeah, je t'aime chérie is I love you, baby. I love French. So <laughs> um, that was nice. Do you have any upcoming performances where we can check you out at? or? Well, actually, I'm an artist from Canada. Okay. So everything looking for is going to be in Canada. Be oh, real. We have wow. a show. I actually have my own show, which is called La Cela, mm -hmm. which means art is here. And it's going to be going down the 27th of November in Montreal. Oh, wow. I don't know if y'all going to fly all the way out there to come, <laughs> but um, you can follow me at zvenstelemac.com because okay. I'll be coming a lot more often in Miami, Florida. Okay. So, Zvenz, it's been a pleasure having you here. And whenever you're ready, I'd like to welcome you back to the Mystery of Show, okay? It's a pleasure. Thank you, Miss uh, Adria. You have a wonderful day. Thank you. All right. I'm the only one. Welcome back, and I'm with Zavins, and we actually see that Zavins has a book, and what is the title of your book? The name of my book is Pen of a Ready Writer. Okay, and what is it about? This book talks about everything. Basically, this book is like when you have a knife in your back, and you slide it through a napkin. Instead of using a napkin, I use this book. And the blood, sweat, and tears were characters that turn into words, that turn into paragraphs, that turn into poems. Wow. So this so captured everything. So it's, it's a book full of poems. Yeah, a book full of all of the poems that I perform. And uh, it basically talks about everything from like uh, that's rape to if Haitian blood were oil to frustration to uh, 
everything. I cover everything in this book. Wow. Okay. So for all of the people watching, please tell us where we can get this book. From. You can get this book at zvenstelemac.com. You can get it also at amazon.com. You'll also notice that there's other people that have the same title, but if this book looks like this, pretty much is mine. Okay. So like I said, Zavan, it's been a pleasure having you here. And for all of you who are watching, please go check out his book, and I look forward to reading it. Pleasure myself. is all mine. You have a wonderful show, and, I, and I, I wish you guys all the great success. Thank you so much. A pleasure.